uh, Debian GNU Linux tutorial videos installation and I am Rani Ahmed now uh, how we will get uh, Debian we will have to go to this page on debian.org on this link and then download by going to this link and then select for an Intel machine uh, i386 or AMD 64 bit if you are an AMD 64 Athlon or uh, here if you I want to download uh, DVDs okay I'll go for the DVD to show you an example the CD-ROM uh, is the same CD-ROM just take the uh, first three it's enough it's enough you can take them all it's enough, uh, it's enough for a DVD to take the first one okay those files must be transformed as normal files you have uh, nor as a normal CD a true CD you have to tell the, uh, the CD burning tool uh, to uh, write uh, write or burn CD from an .iso image from an ISO image it will transform it to you as a normal CD with many files how to download it you go to down best uh, one of the download managers uh, like FlashGuard I love my FlashGuard I download it uh, um, you download it uh, for free okay and then uh, you just use it to download uh, Debian CDs or the images and then use the uh, burning uh, software CD making software to make your CD okay you must get the first CD always CD number one in the list like here DVD number one or CD number one now select the Intel because I have an Intel machine okay we go back here there's no problem now we will start the machine now we will tell you how to make I have already done a DVD okay uh, this is uh, we will start this machine now imagine there is a machine that's uh, newly done and uh, newly uh, built and we want to install the next over it an empty machine now I press here F2 just and now the CD-ROM has uh, booted how will it uh, reboot uh, how we will force it to boot we will restart now here and and we will go to the boot menu for example this tool is named the BIOS you have, should have something like it it, it asks you go to set up uh, with uh, press delete, press F10, press I don't know what okay now I just have to make the CD-ROM here CD-ROM drive here uh, CD-ROM drive here to be the first one so I'll follow the, uh, the instructions that said here how to change and make the CD around the first booting device. I just click and exit and save the changes. You must save it. Press enter and save the settings of the BIOS. Without the BIOS, there is no computer, of course. Press enter. Now oh, this is uh, Linux is booting for installation. 